So there you have it. The absolute best that the WWE has to offer over the last 20 years. Superstars that by hook or by crook managed to accomplish that oh so rare feat of victory over me. I hope you noticed that not one of those matches ended with me giving up. I have a feeling you can guess why. The only question left unanswered is, who was my greatest opponent? And while I can make a strong case for a number of these talent no problem, I'm more interested in who you, the honorable card-carrying member of the WWE Universe, believe that superstar to be. Randy Orton and I waged countless battles. Every time I stepped into the ring with Batista, it was like worlds colliding. Edge was a big pain in my you-know-what for years, and I've never been able to defeat Roman Reigns. The Rock and I made history, while Brock took me to Suplex City. AJ Styles and Kurt Angle were peerless. Every encounter with them was a test of nerves that demanded perfection. Rob Van Dam went to the extreme with an arena full of people happy to see him do it. Triple H took a WrestleMania loss to heart and waited for his chance to get revenge. And The Undertaker? Well, he's The Undertaker. So go ahead, make your choice, and I'll see you both in the ring. I'll just have you know that I'm feeling in tip-top shape, almost unbeatable. Cena and Reigns. This is a going to be a classic, and it may be a short one as well. Can you believe how Cena oh. pulled Reigns out of the air into the attitude adjustment? And Cena with a win. I cannot believe how quickly John Cena just disposed of Roman Reigns. Ah, uh, that had to feel good for Big Match John here tonight. A big match, a big moment, and now it's time for John Cena to enjoy it. Hey, now I hope all those wins didn't get you thinking you were just gonna roll me over. Don't get discouraged though. Happens to the most accomplished superstars in WWE history. And there's no shame in losing to me. There's only shame in giving up. Never give up. Dust yourself off and come back when you're ready. I'll be right here waiting. The following is scheduled for one fall, making his way to the ring, representing the Bloodline from Pensacola, Florida, weighing in at 265 pounds, Roman Reigns! One of the most competent men in WWE today. Go, go, go! You feel the aura of the arena change the minute the opening notes of his song hit, Roman Reigns changes the feeling in the building. It's all about his yard, plain and simple.
protecting his Samoan family legacy on top of the food chain. A main eventer since day one, but now is tougher than ever. The internet was right. It's Super Cena. Ah, uh, we are so lucky to be seeing him. Well, I do. And his opponent from West Newbury, Massachusetts, weighing in at 251 pounds, John Cena! I didn't think Cena could be any more of a difficult opponent, but look at this. Not only invisible limbs, but he's got the highest rating possible. Probably easier said than done. He is in for the fight of his life. Settle once and for all who truly is the face of the company, who truly is the man who runs things around here. It's the face that runs the place against the head of the table, gentlemen. They both know there can only be one winner, but neither of these men plans to be the one who gives up the mantle here. And look, let's call a spade a spade. This is a very unique situation. We've always heard John say, you can't see me, but we never took it literally like we are tonight. Well, I didn't know that Cena was capable of it, but it's a reality now. We truly can't see John Cena. Hey, do you guys think if I wave my hand in front of my face, I'll turn invisible too? No, please try it, Byron. We would love to see you disappear. Cena warded him off. Cena and Reigns, both proficient brawlers, both superstars who love to bring the fight to their opponents. How do you think those similar styles are going to line up tonight? Well, I'd argue that Reigns has the more explosive style than Cena, Cole, and Cena needs to be wary of that style because it's one thing to get hit in the face, but it's another thing entirely to get hit in the face by the tribal chief. Goodness gracious, the big dogs unleashed. Yeah, Roman is pouring it on against Cena. Oh, look at this neck lock into it. Suplex! Cena plans in motion. Up high! Back in the ring now. Oh, God, that, that, that's a bad landing. I don't care how much matting you put on the floor, you are feeling the cement after that miss. A snap mayor. Staved off that attack. He's feeling the effects of that last hit. Powerbomb. A powerbomb's not meant to be pretty, but oh man, does it get the job done. Yeah, I'm pretty sure they don't want to be taking any more of those. Kick to the gut. Here's the pump handle. Suplex. Launched. And Cena's starting to falter here. Cena's just trying to weather the storm. From the apron. What? Lots of potential for injury here at ringside. These superstars better be careful. The floor, the barricades, our table. None of these things are fun to collide with. He's taking is starting to pile up. 
placed in the corner. Setting him up for something here. And that cuts Cena right off. in the corner. Uh-oh. Uh -oh. <laughs> Reigns put his stamp on this one. Makes the cover. A kick out. I don't believe it. Going up against John Cena has to be intimidating enough. And then he's able to kick out like that. Unbelievable. And Reigns absolutely can't believe it. But he cannot let that slow him down. Oh, my gosh. What impact. Tackle. And there's the Yuranagi. Landed them. Ooh! That hurt. The big dog is unleashed. Reigns is picking up steam. That hit catch from Roman Reigns. Oh, that is going to leave a mark. Oh, just turned that around. Gary up there. Oh, flipping the script on him there. He went right into that turnbuckle. And Cena with the wherewithal to counter. Get his purse. This could do it. Quick shoulder up. How? How? He catches Cena with a counter. the franchise John Cena. Yeah, Roman's pride was on the line coming into this thing, but the Tribal Chief has once again shown everyone that he deserves his spot at the top of the mountain.